Hello everybody, welcome to Russia. So what I want to do today is make a navigation exercise and uh, try and show you how I, will, how, how I get around in a place I don't know without a map, just with a compass and uh, always returning to the starting point. We're also gonna need a tracking device and I just happen to have an app on my smart 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 smartphone and uh, it's a tracking app it's not a navigation app so uh, but it's cool it shows you the elevation speed and location and average speed and uh, of course the route you have been traveled so uh, hang on so what we're gonna do is we're gonna set the compass to go due south so we're gonna hit 10 minutes due south and see what's gonna happen In conditions like this, where you have a high, nice sunshine, you just use the sun as a, as a focus point for where you are, where your direction is. Meaning you don't have to get your compass out all the time. So 10 minutes have passed. The tracker also agrees on this. So we have our compass here. We were set for dead on south. So now we want to change direction to 90 degree angle. That's over there of course. Oops. So we're gonna head in that direction for the next 10 minutes. Now we scouted our area on the 90 degrees so now we're gonna put the compass on 45 degrees to get us back to the starting point. We hit the open field here. There's a lot of snowshoe here. Widowmaker, anybody? <laughs> That's bad. So we're back, and pretty successful, I'll say. And 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 I don't know this area. It, it's nothing like that. But I mean, here's the here's the tracks we started from down there. We actually started like up there, four meters away. But uh, let's check the statistics of the route and see how it looks. So we did 1.19 kilometers. Our average speed was 1.34 kilometers an hour. And max speed was 3.40 kilometers an hour. And as you'll be able to see on the photo, we actually did a pretty nice straight sided triangle. But the cool thing about this triangular navigation is that if you can do the math and so on and are not too exhausted or something like this, then uh, all triangles will be 180 degrees. So you'll always be able to calculate your way back to where you started or anyway, like uh, sort of like where you started. And then of course the easiest way is to take a 90 degree triangle Make it 10 minutes long here, 10 minutes long here. You can use any time frame you like. But it doesn't matter how you stretch it, this triangle will always be 180. And uh, if you do the right math, it should always bring you back to the camp or wherever you want to come back. That's a good way to scout your area. So check the links and uh, subscribe and like and all this stuff. See you on Facebook and see you next time in Russia.